What's going on guys? I am standing here with my main man, Nigel from Elite Force here at SHOT Show 2017. And we have a new sniper rifle that they are actually unveiling this year. Nigel, thanks so much for taking the time. What do we got, man? Absolutely. Uh, so this is gonna be from the Ares Amoeba line. This is the Striker bolt action sniper rifle. Um, these are gonna be available in black, OD, tan, and what you're holding there in gray, which is really cool. Um, so yeah, bolt action sniper rifle. One of the really unique things about this is it's gonna use a AEG spring. So finding springs or swapping out springs is gonna make it uh, relatively easy and cheap for you guys. Um, really short bolt pole on these things, about two and a half inches. Uh, makes it really easy for smaller stature guys or if you just don't really wanna work out your right arm in a day at Airsoft. I get, I get that. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm sure a lot of people work out their arms enough yeah, already. So sure. the other he, quick thing about this rifle that's really nice is you actually have an open bolt system here. So if you're on the field and you're not quite sure if you have a BB chamber, this is a really nice feature. And on the flip side, you also have a little fire indicator here. And this is gonna let you know if the bolt is pulled back yeah. and ready to go. So those two features uh, are actually really well thought out. I mean, really props to you guys for developing something that gives the shooter um, a lot more tools to understand the rifle on the field. Attention to detail, yeah, yeah, very nice. Very nice bells and whistles on this thing for sure. Uh, it's gonna come with a 60 round magazine. Uh, the other really cool thing, again, with the bells and whistles, just the feature, it does have your traditional push forward lever, but it also has the trigger guard, uh, similar like HK style mag yeah, release. Yeah, yeah. Uh, kind of a reverse HK style, which is nice. Uh, extra magazines will be available at time of release. Um, what can we expect in terms of price and release date? Uh, so this is going to be matte protected at 175. So right. that sub 200 level uh, release date. I think we're going to be expecting a late spring, early summer on this. Um, we're doing some final, some final uh, little tweaks to it to make sure that it's going to uh, perform the way it should for you guys out right. there in the field. Now this. I'm gonna set the mic down real fast. The one thing I did want to ask about is this little part back here. The, if, if you can't tell on camera, I'll just show you. This actually is revealed and you do have the Allen keys here. And this is really helpful because if you've ever ordered the Spring Sniper Rifle before, sometimes you don't always get the necessary tools to adjust your hop-up, which on this rifle, the hop-up is here on the top. So that's another nice touch from Elite Force. Absolutely. Or in my, in my case, I didn't have Allen keys. Um, but like if you want to put Takis or Skittles or whatever else you want to put in there, you got that going on. So a lot of options, a lot of versatility with this system. Absolutely. Yeah, there we go. We are at least three or four of these guys in there. So. Well, Nigel, thanks so much for taking the time to review these things. Absolutely, man. Guys, definitely uh, check out Elite Force. Check these bad boys out when they come to market. It's going to be worth some time putting um, at least a, a look, and we're going to probably ho hopefully have a review on these guns using some heavier BBs. So thanks so much, man, and definitely, guys, be sure to check these out.